We now return to Pharaoh, a new era. Monument building again. I looked at the uh, mission I did for this in Pharaoh. I'm not sure what I was doing. Pharaoh Khufu has taken the throne, and as foretold by seers of Horus and Ra, our people have already begun to suffer under his oppression. It is rumored that he plans to begin a colossal building project on the plateau outside Rostja, that he may usurp the renown his father, the wise and benevolent Snofru, has earned from the completion of his two noble pyramids. Peru Khufu has ordered a cluster of quarries to be dug at Tura in the Delta region, where rich deposits of fine white limestone have recently been discovered. You also must build three Mastaba tombs for the nobles of this region, so that Pharaoh may honor their devotion. The quarrying settlement you found shall be named Om, and shall serve as a plentiful source of fine white limestone for many years, though only the gods know what endeavor Pharaoh has planned for its use. The city of Byblos in Lebanon, land of the cedars, has begun trading with the powerful empires of the east. These are Assyria and Ur, in the land called Mesopotamia. Between the two great rivers, and from them, the finest ivory may be obtained by a Byblos. With the arrival of rare and exotic luxury goods such as this, Om is sure to prosper. Khufu has also dispatched a royal governor to Eunet to defend our land against Kushite invaders. Royal viziers look with pity upon the governor charged with this difficult and dangerous task. In the capital, the Egyptian people have begun to enjoy a board game called Senate. This game is normally enjoyed over a pitcher of beer in a public gathering place called a Senate House. Such places may provide a welcome diversion for the people of Om from the tyranny of Khufu's authority. So we don't have very much money at the beginning of this mission, so we have to be very cautious about what we do. But lots of our partners, like all of them, buy limestone. So I think what I want to do immediately is get limestone trade up and running. I think this is the obvious place to start building, because it's so close to all this other crap. And uh, the game updated a few times, so I don't know even what they updated, but what appears to have been missing now is the cheat button. Uh, I've got it activated still, but now it's gone. So that sucks, because at the very least I was using it for finishing the monuments, and now that we've got three, it's going to take a while. But anyway, I will pause and set up a few housing blocks. All right. It's going to get real tight. I've already set up some limestone and a trade partner. So we can hopefully start making money right away. I had considered building housing blocks here. It's kind of a pain in the ass to get food to them, though. Because this does not actually allow too much. You can get like five in here. Still not done because uh, I forgot some things. <laughs> Shouldn't put that there. I should probably save that. Oh, whatever. Love marketplaces enough eventually.
think we're going to rely on another gift from Pharaoh here. If my cheat codes were available, I would just give myself money. I don't know why that got turned off. guys. We're not making anything out of this. You get rid of that, and we are just barely making any kind of profit, but not enough to push me forward. At this point, maybe I should just put myself in debt so I get the, the boost. Forty-six percent unemployed. I guess the first thing they're going to go towards is the limestone thing. In fact, that is, I mean... That's all I got. Because of this distance, it takes way too long for them to get there. Just gonna have to double down on this thing first things first. I uh, can't get one in there. I don't know how long I'm gonna have on this because I mean eventually stuff is gonna be demanded of me and we're not gonna be able to fulfill it. Not to mention like that. Eventually the gods are going to be upset that I'm not able to afford a festival for them. Alright, there's a little bit more. trade partner is going to be 400. Now we're into the new year. So I want to let this year run if I can. Plenty of people, plenty of people. Should I just keep going? I kind of feel like, yeah. I mean, the more, the more I do, the more I make money. I just gotta be careful. I might have to move those guys elsewhere so that they, they hit everything. Instead of running that way and then running this way and then getting short. We also have m money now, so we can probably take... She's congenial. So they've been having festivals for each other. Fast has, anyway. Okay. I think it's time. I should probably move that. I should move it to, like, here or something. be easier to offset the bad appeal for that anyhow. Okay. 
Let's start with one. I mean, there's, there's no need for that. 126 people yet. This alone is a thousand people, huh? That's where that should go, is right there. Okay, now that we're able to provide them some stuff... That'll get them up. And the next thing will be getting um, taxes. Produce a lot of extra food. Okay. Now the second granary would be good, but I want to make sure I got room yet. In fact, I think with what short distance we have, we don't really need that because every time this empties, they'll just keep dragging food to it. We don't need a, an extra storage. So I won't worry about it. Okay, this is filling up now. It's time to call in partner number two. That will double my trade opportunities. In fact, uh, we're just doing it over zero, so... This should now be more than enough. December. Just to make sure... Yeah, they already, they already hit their cap. So, starting next month here... where we're still making money. Increased trading to Saqqara. They'll buy even more limestone. Which is the partner we just opened up. I... Do you lie? Increased trading. Because it's growing, it's now willing to trade even more limestone. It was 40 at the beginning, it is now 40 again, so <laughs> that's excellent. Probably keep up on this stuff. Oh good, she, she is. She is doing my work for me, that's really good. What's the deal? Cerebility. Now this is a cheap way to expand, so should be doing so. When I say cheap, I mean relatively so. Next is entertainment. Be sure to hold off on that until we get everybody else up to snuff. I'm seeing some emptiness here. So, I need to make sure we're not over... We're filling our people here. Check my trade partners. They maybe could have done something a little better. 25? Maybe it was only 25, not 40. I guess so, because everyone's at 25. Okay, never mind. But... We're full there too, so still do another trading partner, 450. Yeah, you know what? Let's do it because it's only August, so that's yet another person. 
to sell to. Another opportunity for profit. And then whatever else we can sell. Let's look what else we can sell. Bricks. Bricks. Barley beer. Linen. Nobody, we can't go up to linen. Nobody sells the stuff. I don't know if I make flax. I do. So I could sell flax. Because I could just open up some flax fields right there, develop it, and then sell it right there. That would be good. To that end... Maybe I should just create a little loop here. That way they just dump it and then bring it to there rather than whatever. It's, it's close enough. We don't need to mess with that. Okay. Um, well, we're, we're making money. It's a good thing. And I guess we just continue on with the desirability thing. Help these guys grow. Two hundred more people. Fifty-four, that's four hundred people. Okay. Perhaps it is time to set that aside for a moment. Shipwright, quarries, clay pit. We can make clay now on our own, which means we can make brick on our own, which means we can fund a mastaba on our own. This could just be mastaba row right here. Just keep it all, all nice and tidy, real close by. Or even just set it way out here, kind of far away. But I think right here is good, because we're not using that land. Or even this land, I mean... We do have burial goods. Oof. Damn. Maybe I should put this away before I go expanding further. Didn't realize we need that many burial, burial goods. 800 wood? 800 jewelry, that's gonna blow. We are not gonna be able to do that until much, much later. It's gonna be real bad. So what the hell do we need sandstone for? We don't make anything that requires that. Okay. Well, I had thought of using this as a little loop here or industry that we immediately export. If we were to use that for flax and then create the little flax makers right here, they could just ship it straight across. So what was gonna go here? We can make our own pottery. I think I saw pottery. Yeah. I mean, we're going to need a ton of money to offset all this crap. But, because I can no longer cheat monuments to be done, finishing the monuments early would be really good. Maybe I should just get them out of the way. Just, like, line the river here with them. Because then, then nothing needs to be done with it. I'm not going to put another dock down. You can't... In the, this game... Unlike Nebuchadnezzar, they don't like having more than one dock, so they only go to the one. So yeah, I mean, I guess we just put it down here, and then just kind of create a, a separate little field for Mastabas. Alright. Did that cost me money? No. Good. Um... Pinch that right there. I mean, it's there, it fits here. I'm trying to think, because I'm going to need. No, I don't want to put it there, because all the Mastabas are going to go on that side, so.
brick. Jesus. Right, and, and this one... Okay. You're freaking kidding me. Might be a little problematic there. She has stopped giving gifts. I guess maybe I should have kept going with that. I guess when you're when you're poor, the gods take pity on you and you get better blessings, maybe. They need straw. I guess that's too far away for these guys to deliver? not forget to turn that off. Okay, that's a problem. They're not moving the straw. Do I really have to have it here? Once it's here, they're going to get it elsewhere, right? Fuck. Okay, well for the game meet, we need to come over here for that. Got birds over here.
since we don't necessarily have to bring that to anybody, I might just be able to get away with having it stockpile over here. fire risk and cannot collapse. Good, I don't even have to build that. But I'm going to need them for the distribution stockpile. So, irrelevant. Game. Uh, so I did notice that the developers said that they are thinking about adding um, a minimap. They have heard the cries of the people, and in their generosity, they're thinking about adding a feature that they took out of the fucking game. I'm working on it, Pharaoh. Is that going to be a thing? Because if it's not, I can delete all this stuff right now. Not that I really need the people, but I also don't need the meat. Meat is not something we can sell. We can import it. I could... Just turn it off. which doesn't seem to be getting rid of the people, it just means they're not working anymore, so okay, let's... Okay. Now we can go back to what's important over here. Okay, finally they get the straw. What the hell's going on there? So I guess that means... I don't know. I don't... I don't know. I don't know. Like... I need to see... I need to see their chain. I need to see what they're going to do. Uh, we can probably give Ra a nice big festival. I need to watch what these guys do now. Four percent unemployment. I uh, might be a good idea. Got that seven hundred. Let's let it go a bit more. I don't really want to dip below two thousand at this point. It's a little harsh. But we don't seem to be making any money anymore. 1400 in exports, we better be making some money. Festivals are costing a lot. Come on, season. Alright. 
So when we say get, are they traipsing all the way up here? It kind of looks like it. I have to go clear across the city with these goods. So they don't empty it from here, they go after it. Let's see. We are going to want to shortcut that for them. Just a little bit. These guys don't even need this. Yeah, this is uh this is not smart. I should move that. I should move that before we actually get started. If if that is the case, it would be better to put them over here. We don't really need it for industry. Because I, I do have plenty of space here, which is just as nearby, but like it would be way better to have it over there. I want to see. Should get all the, uh, these back. Uh, it didn't cost me anything to get rid of that, so. How far back can I push these? Not too far. I could line them up that way. Okay. Just thinking here. So right now, it looks as though we can maybe supply two, uh, which is weird. They got a lot of clay. Why are they not moving stuff? Okay, well, regardless, um, let's come up here, except none, except straw to a quarter, except brick. Two, three. All right. Let us empty and empty. And then I guess I'll just delete this stuff because there's no point to what I'm doing right now. Thinking of move all that stuff, yeah. I'll empty that out and we'll delete it. So I really just need the two for now. is unfortunately not what's going to fit there, but... This, this whole island is going to be a bit of a cluster, I can feel. Cyrus is only sympathetic. Why is that? If anything, it's Bast who should be pissed off. She's... It's been a while since we've posted anything for her. Okay, we good? A little bit of straw left. You know what? Now that we're actually able to get the stuff... All good. Um, how are we doing on the selling... I shouldn't. I should have checked that uh, last year, but whatever. Okay, are we, are we still all cool? I mean, no. <laughs> like, everyone's. Just because this is 
it's starting to make me nervous. Alright, so we have a sum. We now are going to need, uh, I guess, at least one work camp. If this thing wasn't going to snarl traffic, I would consider just making one big long line here. I guess we can see how well it works. If anything, I guess I can put another one from here. We definitely need extra work camps. I don't know, I don't know. Man, like... Because every one I fit in here... So if I fit that and then I fit that, we're going to be real tight. So it's not like I can keep building there, so... I think we are going to have to look at this differently. Still got a bit of that left. Thank you, Bast. So yeah, with with the, the excess straw that we're gonna have here, and we can see it, that'll help me gauge how many more brick makers I need to do. It's gonna be a lot. It's gonna be an awful lot. As we get closer to December here, I'm going to pause and then we'll see if we're in need of more limestone producers. I mean, if we can just keep her happy, she'll keep the others happy, in theory. Filled up them, did not fill up them, and did not fill up them. So, I think yes, we can go for more. Because we have even one more trade partner we could have to sell all this stuff to. Now that line is getting very long. I think, out of caution, I'm just going to go ahead and do this. What is bothering me is that with all this expansion, I'm still not making much money. So I think we will need to flip over and start doing taxes. Although, I don't know. Without any taxes, we're kind of guaranteeing that we're getting people to move in. But, oh, I'll, I'll just have to keep doing that trick. So let's go ahead. Uh, that's going to put me down below 2000. <laughs> Well, hold on for just a minute here. Um, okay, you're gonna need you're gonna need to get. I need this out of here. I don't even know if I need that anymore. Let's just see now if they'll take it across the water next time. Yeah, we, we uh, got a bit of a straw here, so we need a bit more pot makers. So, da -da -da -da, that's the wrong one. I can feel like one more right there. Clay. Okay. I guess we're going to have to start putting that stuff down here now. Because here's where we're going to get close to the water to, to do that. Okay. 
And because of that, we can also now at least get one brick layer. Start using it. I think we're kind of... So much for making money. Let's uh, let these guys go, because... Okay, that's the last bit of money we can make for a while, Pharaoh. It's 25 again. Yeah, let's just keep her happy. She's doing my work for me. Seven. Damn it. All right, we good? We're good. Jesus. There was all my profits for this year. give it one more year of making money, then we'll put down a palace and start taking taxes. And maybe that'll... Zakara will trade even more. How much is even more? Okay, that did, that did not go above 40. Inundation will be blessed and perfect. me see. Yeah, it did not go above 40. So maybe I wasn't crazy the first time. I don't fucking know. How's our danger, by the way? Or is this actually working? Okay. They're still able to go that far. So No collapsing there. That will be very nice. I think once this mastaba is done, I'm going to fill that in with brick again before starting the next one, just so we can plow through it. Okay, I think we've got enough money now. We can justify putting down a palace, which was too big. That's way too big. I forgot how big this damn thing is. Um, I was going to use it to offset this little distribution hub I was building up in here. I guess it'll still do that. It'll just take space away from this. So we're probably going to have to delete a, a few houses along the backside there. Uh, I mean, there's no other place to put it, so... It's best to use it. I mean, I could just have it hanging off the edge up in here. But it is going to be neat, necessary to offset the bad appeal here. Because, I mean, where, where are we at with that? Yeah, uh, that's <laughs> not so great. Okay, and then because of that, we can now take taxes. Here, I guess. Sure. I don't think we're going to get too much out of this. We do get some, but it's not a lot. I want to see what one month of taxes gives me. She just threw me another festival. So one month at 200. That's that's going to be good. If I can get everybody latched up into that. Excelente. Where are we at on people? 27 still. Which translates to 200 people. Okay. So really, I could, I could bash this out a lot. But what I think I should be doing... Uh, is focusing more on the selling stuff. So maybe getting a little pottery thing out here. Um, what else can we sell? 
papyrus, so reeds. That's quite a distance. But I could turn reeds into papyrus. I'm sure that pays well, actually. Let's uh, take a look. Let's see, beer is 210, papyrus is 247 and a half. Why they went with 0.5s, I'm not really sure. But yeah, um, that's money right there. In fact, I mean, we're going to have to import a lot of jewelry. But like if we traded it for the papyrus, we wouldn't be losing that much. And if we did uh, linen, linen and papyrus would allow me to buy that jewelry. And I can also do pottery. Pottery is only 157, but it's also cheap. Maybe we should wait on this until I get done with the, the mastabas so I can utilize the clay. Because otherwise, I'm afraid that you're going to have these clay industries fighting for who they deliver to. But flax is easy. I mean, we can do it right here. Turn it into linen. Bam. And linen, a lot of money. And then maybe go for papyrus since it's going gonna, it's gonna to take a lot longer. Yeah, I think that's the, the smart thing to do. It's right here. So, okay. Well, I'll end this one here. Um, I... Never mind, I'm not going to say it, I'm not going to jinx it. I'll see you next time.